making a connection. A young boy using a popular toy to bring grandparents all the way from India right into his living room. 7 News at 6 starts now. A young boy in Lexington is building a relationship with his parents using Legos and a little technology. Those grandparents live all the way in India and can't visit very often. Yes, yeah, so what does he do? Well, block by block, this grandson puts together a way for them to stay connected. Sandin's seventh Brandon Gunnow with the story. Like it, as you saw, like nine-year-old like, Ricky Kundu really built a robot with and Legos. So, like, there's a color block here, and this color sensor. Sees its it. name is BetaBot. Beta meaning child in Hindi and early prototype in English, and it allows him to stay in touch with his grandparents, who live thousands of miles away in India. We can only see each other in um, person over like the summer. It all started with the Legos robotics team that Ricky and a few of his friends are a part of. This year's project was to come up with an invention to help seniors. My team had the idea of building a telepresence robot so that way like um, we could uh, okay, take stop. our grand grandparents with us um, even when they're not here like on the go. The robot uses a tablet and Skype for video conferencing and the grandparents can control its movement. Plus, you can control the robot from either computer on either side, and it uses color to decide which direction it's going to go. So red makes it go right, blue makes it go left, green makes it go forward, black makes it stop, and white makes it go in reverse. Even grandparents like mine in India can communicate with their grandchildren that could be like 3,000 miles away. And it's just in time for the holidays. Hey. In Lexington, I'm Brandon Gano, 7 News. I've got many years on him, and I don't think I would ever, ever have thought of anything <laughs> near that. Nine. Can you I could put a couple Legos old? together. And could you see the intensity in his eyes as <laughs> Good he for was him. explaining it? All right. Good for him. We should write his name down. Mm -hmm. It was Ricky. I remember that. <laughs> we'll see him again. All right, Pete, are uh, you impressed? Down for MIT, huh? Maybe become a really good forecaster, too. You never know. Hey,